Here's how these centipede-like creatures work in the Path of Ren. The game object is made up of a visual for the hole they come out of, the centipede parts which consist of a head part and any number of body parts, and a detection radius to determine when the player is within range. All of the centipede parts are made completely transparent at the start to make it appear as though it's hiding inside of the hole, and when the player enters the detection radius, each part fades in one at a time to make it look like it's coming out of the hole. For the centipede's movement, it's a simple algorithm where the head part follows and rotates towards the player, and each body part just follows and rotates towards the part in front of it in the chain. The speed at which it follows the player starts off a bit slow, like the centipede is stalking the player, but when the centipede gets close enough, it speeds up significantly to make it feel like it's now on the attack. And of course, if the player comes in contact with any of the parts, they'll have to try that section over again. But if the player manages to escape, all of the centipede parts retract back towards the hole and fade out as soon as they reach their initial positions, making it appear as if the centipede is going back inside of the hole. 